when it is really hot outside, not only do your succulents need some shade, but so do you. Okay, I'm finally going to pot these uh, pots up that hang on my wall. And I have a couple, couple of succulents here that I'm going to put in this one into each pot. So the first thing I'm going to do is clean these up. They've been in these pots for a really long time. And the dirt in here is not the best. I've had these, oh gosh, maybe for four months or more, and I have not repotted them. Okay. Oop. I broke broke one of the leaves. I want to make sure there are no bugs in here. All right. I'm going to do the same with this one and then get rid of this dirt. Pretty dry. I definitely didn't overwater them. Ooh, I don't like the way this looks. See that? There are some roots here. Well, I will plant it and see how it does and I'll keep you updated on what's going on. Okay, let me get rid of this dirt and I'll be right back. Okay, I have some cacti uh, and uh, citrus soil mix and I added a little bit of perlite to it. So I'm gonna go ahead and plant up the sick looking one first. Okay, there's a real small drainage hole on the bottom of this. So I don't think I need to put a screen in there. It's pretty small. All right, let's fill them up with dirt. I'm just gonna fill it pretty much to the top. I hope this does well. holding on to it and then I'll show you where the, I'm going to hang them all right that's looking pretty good I'll put some top dressing rocks on it after I get the other one potted. This might be a purple delight, I'm not sure. Okay, set that up against here. Let's get to the other one. Now for the top dressing, I'm not going to put anything too nice in there because it's going to be hanging up on a wall and you're not going to really see the top dressing. But this is mainly to help keep moisture in the pot. Okay, that one's looking pretty good. Let's tackle this guy. And I have two more pots that I need to plant. Okay, let's get these hung up on the wall. All right, let's get this guy hung. And here's the other one.
Okay, two more to go, and I'll show you which ones they are. This one and the other one. And it's nice and shady here. I have the soil in the pot, a few succulents here. Now these were in some pots and I did not like the look of the soil. So I decided to uh, cut the roots off and uh, most of the roots off and wash them off. Okay, this one, let me see. I'm not sure if that's some mealy bug there or not. Yeah, I think it might be. I'm gonna, well, yeah, I'm gonna set this one aside. All right. This one's looking good. Okay, I'm not going to have too many plants in here. And they'll get bigger so that you'll be able to see them. This one, I also did the same. I uh, cut some of the roots off and then went ahead and washed them. So I'll put this to the side here. Let me dig a better hole. There we go. And let's put this one in. I did the same thing, washed it off. I'm not going to be watering these in. Oh, this one's planted, so. Okay, that one looks pretty good. Put that one over here. You know what, I think I'm gonna put a little bit more soil in here raise it up just a little. There. All right. Let's put this in here, the sedum morganum. I think this is sedum donkey tail. I'll put this off to the side. Here's a rock here. I'm going to anchor that one a little bit. Okay. I think that looks pretty good for now, so I'll get this one hung up in a minute, and now I just need to find some plants for the other planter, but let's put some rock in here. Okay, hold on, I'll be right back. This one is gonna, going to be a little sparse looking too. Right here, I have a... Uh, lovely rose so I'm going to put that in the middle here put this guy eh, a couple of them here I may need to go find another plant I'm going to put a couple rocks behind this to make sure it stands up. There. A little more dirt. And since these all have roots, I can water them unless I put something in here as a cutting. And I need another couple rocks.
like I said, they'll grow and I'll put some more cuttings in here later. Okay, I'll get them up on the wall and show you what they look like. Okay, let's check it out. I did add another plant I'll show you. Remember this one that I said had the uh, mealy bug? I went ahead and cleaned it up really good and planted it here. So here is this. Like I said, they're not, you know, super full, but they will get full. Now you can see this. This I planted, I think, well over a year ago, and I could probably behead them and stick them back in, but for now I'm going to leave it. And then here is the other one, and they will get bigger so it'll look nicer down the road so that's it for now thank you for watching check back with me again to see what I'm up to bye